Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Kay, Malligator Mom. And today our video is gonna be short and sweet. So it's basically in response to a lot of the questions that I was getting about the last video with uh, the training session and talking about recall. You guys wanted to see how I teach recall um, you know, more in action than just kind of me blabbing about it like, like in the last video, it makes total sense. So I wanted to put this short video together just for you guys to show you how it is I work on recall with my puppy. At this age, she is um, just over nine weeks old. And so this is a fundamental that you guys need to be working on all the time. I work on her recall many, many times a day all throughout the day. And um, so I went out this morning and used her potty break this morning just as an opportunity to teach recall. And um, I'm gonna show you guys how that went. And keep in mind that this short session that I'm about to show you was I think like two or three minutes long. And um, that's just out here in the morning. But keep in mind, I'm doing those little two or three minute sessions all throughout the day, many times a day. So it's not just one time a day in the morning. It's many, many times a day you need to be working on this. And so this video kind of breaks down how to do that. It's really simple. So if you have any comments, go ahead and, you know, drop me a line. I'll make sure to get back to everybody. But um, you guys want to see it? Here it is. So one of the questions that I get asked pretty often is how long are you spending training your puppy? Uh, how many sessions do you do a day? How long do those sessions last? That kind of thing. And um, that's actually kind of a hard question to answer because the truth is, is that I spend all day working with my puppy because she's learning all day from everything that we do. So this is a perfect example. I would not call this a training session by any means, but I'm gonna use this opportunity to work on her recall. So we're out here um, for our morning potty break. And this is a great opportunity since I've got my bag of treats already with me, since we're working on potty training, obviously, to um, just take a minute to work on that recall. So I'm gonna let her get distracted and then I'm going to do whatever I can to get her attention um, I'm not going to be using the command come or here or let's go right now because um, I don't have any way to reinforce that. She's not on a lead, which means if I'm using that command and I don't have success in getting her to come to me, I've just taught her it's okay to ignore that command. So at this point, she's 10 weeks old, I'm just going to do whatever I can to get her attention and to get her to come to me. And that is whatever it takes. Shaking a bag of treats, um, making funny noises to get her attention, whatever you gotta do. And then the second that she does come to you, then you give her a reward and lots of praise. So she's distracted, which is a great opportunity for me to try to get her attention and get her to come to me. And I am gonna use her name because we're working on name recognition. So let's see. Storm, Storm. Bup, 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 bup. Oh, good girl, good girl an immediate paycheck. So then we're going to let her get distracted again. And we'll do this probably three or four times in the morning, just working on her recall. And it doesn't take long. It's like five minutes of your time. And, um, and that'll be it. And then we'll go inside. Storm! Boop, 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 boop. Storm! Good girl! Good girl. All right, again, let's just wait for her to get distracted. Put a little distance between us. See, she knows I've got the treats now. She loves this grass. As you can see, she's flattened half of it. She got not follow mama because she knows she got the treats. There we go, nice and distracted. Storm! Bop, 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 bop. Shaking the bag, using her name, whatever you gotta do to get her to come to you. And then she gets paid. And sometimes you want it to be a jackpot. You don't want one treat for one action. That gets really boring. It needs to kind of be like a slot machine. She never knows. Is she gonna come get like three or four treats or is she just gonna get one for every time she comes back to you? So we'll do it one more time. I'll wait for her to get distracted again. She's really using her nose this morning. Kind of want her to get some distance, but she never really does go too far from me. All right, storm! Boop, 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 boop. Good 
good girl good girl and that's it